Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for January 18th of 2022. Well, it is titled from Orion to the Southern Cross. So what do we see here? Well, this is an image of the sky taken from Australia and looking across a large portion of the sky, starting with Orion on the left hand side and ending up with Crux, the Southern Cross over on the right hand side. Now to help identify these, they are labeled for you. So we can go ahead and look at those with some labels on them to help better identify these. And we can see Orion there on the left hand side. And that's a very familiar constellation to many who look at the sky and we see three bright stars in the belt. And then hanging up from the belt is Orion Nebula. And the bright star at the upper right here is Rigel and at the upper left is Rigel and the lower right is Betelgeuse, the very red star there. Now, for those who observe in the northern hemisphere, you will note that this looks upside down. We're used to, for those of us in the northern hemisphere, are used to seeing uh, Betelgeuse on the upper left and Rigel in the lower right. However, here we are looking upside down because we are in the southern hemisphere. We are essentially looking at everything from a completely different perspective, and therefore we see everything upside down due to the curvature of Earth. Now as we look a little further to the right here we see some other constellations such as Canis Major and Canis Minor uh, the two dogs so the hunting dogs following Orion through the sky and the constellation of Lepus up above and then we see in the middle there the bright star Sirius which is the brightest star in the sky other than our own sun of course. As we move further along, we can see the Gum and Carina nebulae. So we can see a couple of different nebulae there as we head over toward the right hand side of the image. Now towards the right hand side, we see a couple of other interesting things up towards the top, we see what are labeled as the LMC and SMC. And those are the two Magellanic clouds, the large Magellanic cloud to the left, and just to the edge of it edge of the image, the small Magellanic cloud. And those are two small satellite galaxies of our own Milky Way. So there are other two galaxies that you can see that are only visible if you are south of the equator. They are relatively far south in the sky, meaning that for most of us at northerly latitudes, they never rise above the horizon. So we never get a chance to see uh, these galaxies. However, south of the equator, they are very prominent in the sky and you can very easily see a fuzzy patch in the sky at these two locations. And then finally ending up with the Southern Cross kind of hidden a little bit in the uh, clouds down there just above the horizon uh, is this constellation of Crux known as the Southern Cross. There's also a Northern Cross in the nor Northern, Northern Hemisphere as well. So here we can see a, a number of different things from stars to nebulae uh, to galaxies and groupings that we group together as constellations on the sky all here taken from Australia. So that was our picture of the day for January 18th of 2022. It was titled from Orion to the Southern Cross. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be big galaxy approaches. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.